Black Mamba is done, baby. Black Mamba is done. Ah, yeah. All right. It's been a little bit since I made a video on here. It's been about two and a half weeks, and it's been a kerfluffle of different things that have happened and basically delayed me making another video. And one is massive amount of thunderstorms cutting out power or me just being paranoid and not wanting to fry my electronics. We just had a thunderstorm pass and I have, it's been about 10 minutes since I heard thunder, so I just turned everything on. Um, yeah. Woo. We've also had power outages, compliments of Florida Light and Power cutting off the entire neighborhood to go work on a main line to prepare for uh, Hurricane Elsa that never materialized over here other than a little bit of wind and some rain. We've had stronger thunderstorms than Hurricane slash Tropical Storm Elsa. Black Mamba is done. It is done. And in my last video, I talked about bundle deals. I talked about how they were being, and my vendor was being a jerk. We got a new vendor. And we got a new vendor that doesn't charge retail and that also doesn't do stupid bundle deals. So I don't have to go insane by spending $1,000 to get a $500 card or whatever. Okay, so this got upgraded. Instead of this having a Ryzen 5 3600, it got a Ryzen 5 5600X. It's got still got the 16 gigs of uh, G-Skill Trident Z Neo RAM, but we got it at full speed running on XMP at 3600. I've got uh, the uh, MSI Gaming Trio uh, RTX 3070 in here, uh, the B550 Oris Elite. It's got three drives. It's got the HP EX900 250 gig uh, NVMe uh, boot drive. I've got a 480 gigabyte game drive that's an SSD on SATA, and then I have a one terabyte uh, Seagate Barracuda for a data storage and overflow, and that's just a regular mechanical. 4.0 riser cable from Lian Lai, or Lian Li, or who, however you want to say it. Uh, that's in there. ST120 Lian Li fans. Galahad 240mm uh, AIO for the Ryzen uh, CPU. It's more than adequate. These temps stay nice and cool in here. I'm really, really happy with how it came out. The Project Black Mamba. I just got some cool colors going on in here because it shows up on camera really, really well. Um, you know, we're selling this beast for $2,600. $2,600 and it's all yours. Comes pre-configured. Everything is good. It's got Ryzen Master on PBO. We've got uh, XMP set. Everything is installed and it is done. So all you have to do is literally turn it on, load your games, and that is all you got to do. You don't have to configure anything. You don't have to load keys. You don't have to do... Shit. You don't have to do... You, all you have to do is just turn it on and go in. And I got this cool little nice little background there for you. You could change it to whatever you want. But that lets you know that Windows has been fully activated with a full key. Everything is good. It's legit. It's nice. And I want it for myself. I actually want it for myself. We're going to do some benchmark. Uh, benchmarking. We're going to go superposition bench. I'm gonna run this in the background. Eh, we'll do uh, we'll do 4K optimized. Yeah, yeah, we'll do that. Go on now. I just keep running benches. I just love the way that this thing is just fluid throughout the entire benching process. I had it on 8K optimized, and it was running on average of about 90 FPS. Uh, with everything on 8K. Mm anywhere between 90 and 110 frames per second full load and this thing was it stayed as cool as a cucumber the entire time monitoring temps and hardware monitor I I really want some I, 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 I want somebody to take this thing and have fun with it right now I, I just I can't live FPS let's see on um, 4k average is 88 88 87, 88, 87 average FPS. Minimum is 81. It's max that it's done right now is 102.4 frames per second. And that's on that's on 4K. Awesome. I love it. And I keep saying that. Probably sound like, like the orange man or something. But I'm, I'm excited for it. And I'm excited to go to Comic-Con. And this is, if this doesn't sell by the time that we're at Comic-Con, this is going to be put on as a, as, as a show PC, and we're going to have that there for sale at Comic-Con. We're also going to be doing a raffle for a PC, 
So we're going to be building a PC, going to have a 1650 or a 1660, depending on which one comes in first. It's going to get, it, it, whatever, whatever it goes, it's going to get the Ryzen 5 3600 that I have laying around now. I have, I have a Ryzen laying around, wow. Uh, I never usually keep CPUs and stuff. I sell them or put them in systems, but I'm going to keep this. This is going to be in our raffle. I'm very excited for it. I get all the information and everything is panned out with the venue itself because I need I need a booth number. So as soon as I get a booth number, that's when I'm going to be putting up all the information on YouTube. I'm going to be putting it on Facebook, Instagram, on our website. It's going to be going everywhere that we have a presence. That way you guys can come. Uh, Sunrise Civic Center. Uh, it's August 14th at uh, 11 a.m. is when it starts for you guys. For us, it starts at like 7 a.m. Um, but yeah, I can't wait to see some bit of you if you follow there. And, uh, you know, if you, if you decide to come, you can buy this lovely PC. Oh, look at that. 4K optimized, and it did uh, 11,221, 11, which is... Eh, is decent. That's not the highest score it's gotten. I think. Uh, nope, that's AK optimized at 4,758. Okay, so it's it's gotten a little bit better. Okay. All right. So there we go. It's good. It's doing doing decent. That's it. That's all I got for today. Just wanted to post up this little itty bitty video showcasing um, this PC and some new developments that we've had. All right. Take care.